Beagle Tail Docking, Owner Perspectives Docking, the practice of removing a portion of a dog's tail for cosmetic or practical purposes, has been a topic of debate among dog owners, breeders, and animal welfare advocates for years. One breed that often undergoes this procedure is the Beagle, a popular and beloved family pet known for its friendly nature and characteristic wagging tail. In this video, we will explore the various perspectives surrounding beagle tail docking from the standpoint of owners. Before delving into the owner perspectives, it is important to understand the reasoning behind tail docking. Historical records show that tail docking, which was initially performed for practical reasons such as preventing injuries during hunting or working activities, has transformed into a primarily aesthetic practice in recent times. However, while tail docking is still considered an acceptable procedure in some countries, it is important to note that several countries and animal welfare organizations have banned this practice due to concerns over animal welfare and ethics. When it comes to beagle owners, there is a diverse range of opinions surrounding tail docking. Some owners believe that tail docking is necessary for the well-being of their beagles, especially if they are engaged in activities such as hunting or field trials. These owners argue that docking the tail can prevent injuries, as the tail is prone to getting caught in bushes or doors. Additionally, they claim that docking enhances the beagle's overall appearance and preserves the breed's traditional image. These owners often cite the fact that some breed standards still require tail docking for beagles in certain countries. On the other hand, there are beagle owners who strongly oppose tail docking, viewing it as an unnecessary and cruel practice. They argue that beagles are companion animals rather than working dogs, and therefore, tail docking serves no practical purpose for the majority of beagles. These owners believe that dogs should be allowed to keep their tails intact, as nature intended. They emphasize the importance of respecting the dog's natural anatomy and argue that docking can negatively impact the dog's balance and communication abilities, as the tail plays a significant role in expressing emotions. Another perspective held by beagle owners is centered around aesthetics. Some owners simply prefer the appearance of a beagle with a docked tail, believing it to be more aesthetically pleasing. These owners may have grown up seeing beagles with docked tails and come to associate it with the breed's identity. While not necessarily advocating for the continuation of the docking practice, these owners may choose a beagle with a docked tail when selecting a pet purely based on personal preference. Amidst these varying perspectives, it is crucial to zoom out and consider the broader context. The trend towards banning tail docking in various countries reflects a growing concern for animal welfare and ethical treatment of dogs. Many argue that there are alternative measures to prevent injuries or address aesthetic concerns, such as increased owner responsibility, proper training, and the use of protective gear. It is important for beagle owners, as well as owners of other dog breeds, to be informed about the potential risks and benefits associated with tail docking and to make an educated decision based on what they believe is best for their pet. In conclusion, the topic of beagle tail docking elicits a range of perspectives among owners. Whether it is viewed as a necessary measure for a working beagle, a cruel and unnecessary practice, or simply a personal preference, owners should approach this decision with careful consideration. As conversations surrounding animal welfare continue to evolve, it is important for owners to be well informed about the implications of tail docking and to prioritize the well-being of their furry companions. Ultimately, the decision lies in the hands of the owner, but it should be made with the best interests of the beagle and its quality of life in mind.